Hey guys, what's up? I'm back with a brand new video and in today's tutorial, I'm going to introduce you to the HTML head, body and header part. So without wasting our time, let's just take a deep dive into it. So open up the Visual Studio code and create a new folder. For this tutorial, I'm going to name my folder intro and after creating the folder, now uh, select the folder and click on the new file icon and name your file index.html now the, one of the question arrives that having the index.html file name is good and my answer is no however when you are building a website that have typically entry point file you have been damn index.html and server like uh, if you have host on a server like godaddy or some place just hosting files your static files you look for index.html or index.php to get your project started and loaded on the browser okay perfect so here we're gonna start with uh, something called doc type.html and now this is not an html tag this is simply a statement that let your browser know what version of html that you are being using and currently we are using html5 which is why we don't need to do anything else except HTML while it is being supported by all browsers. If you were developing on Windows, I highly recommend that you do not do anything, any testing on your Microsoft Edge because most people don't use that developer tools are available and better developer tools are available on Firefox and Chrome browsers. So you are starting by typing doc type HTML, which tells which type of version you are working with and some browser you don't need to put that but it can go with problem so I recommend you to put up there next what we are gonna with the writing a HTML tag and this is being the starting of your document okay pretty cool huh the next you wanna do you putting the body and the body is like a content and just think about a person which you got a head you got a body so inside the body you can write different things now just save the document and open it with the live server as you can as you can see our screen is blank is it working well hard to know now so what i want to do is from the very first day i'm going to teach you the professional developer tool uh, you will be using in your live web, web developer so uh, open up the inspector tool and now you can see your codes in the element tab so by pointing the mouse you can see whatever in your body or now we have nothing written in it so now let's move on uh, so let's write something in our body for example if you want to display a banner so if you want to display a banner we can use the any of the heading tag so I'm going to use the h1 tag and the I'm going to write like a speed welcome to the speed academy after that just save your code and go to the browser and check the output for now I'm just opening it with the live server so let's check what our output is as you can see welcome to the speed academy is written over here and now go to the inspector tool and as you can see by pointing the mouse over a head h1 tag the welcome to the speed academy get highlighted in the browser so after that I'm going to use some other heading tags for now I'm going to use the h2 tag and let's just copy the welcome to the speed academy from over and paste it in between the h2 tag and I'm going to use and now I'm going to use the h3 tag so after that I'm just pasting the welcome to the speed academy right over here and uh, let's just launch it over the browser as you can see the three outputs the three heading tags and again you can open up the inspector tool and you can see by pointing the heading tags different heading tags uh, get highlighted over the browser one by one after that you so now if you want to display a title of your web page you can just write the head tag and in between the head tag you can specify the title tag and in between the title tag you can name any of the title head tag is nothing head tags help us in loading the uh, CSS external CSS file and uh, scripts had uh, all all the content which is written in the head tag is not displayed over a website 
but the only one thing that is displayed over your web page is the title tag so i'm going to specify the speed academy title over here and let's just launch it with the live server and let's check what our output is so as you can see my title was changed over here uh, i think this is enough for today's tutorial i hope you guys like my video and if do so comment below thanks for watching